Hello, everyone. It's Dr. Desiree Alexander, aka Educator Alexander, and here's your five minute tip for this week. Remember to click that thumbs up to like this video and subscribe to the channel. So, in this video, I want to show you two ways that you can send people stuff where they can't, let's say, gently reuse or steal your stuff. So, let's get started. The first way works with any of your files. So you can't do it with a whole folder, but of course you can click in that folder and do it with the files. So it will be, if I come here, I'm gonna right click and go to my share. I don't care if you're sharing it this way or if you're sharing it with the link, you're going to come up here to the gear and you're going to uncheck viewers and commenters can see the option to download print and copy so what this is going to do is if you tell google that you want them to be a viewer or a commenter they will not even see the button it's going to be gray out or it just won't be there to download print or make a copy so they can't make a copy and then own their own copy of your work now editors can do whatever they want to because you gave them editing rights right but for viewers and commenters that is how that would work so you would uncheck it. Notice when you check and it says they will see it. Uncheck it, they won't see it. So uncheck it, click the arrow, and you are done. You can share it however you want to share it, and they will not see that option. Now, the second way is the way that you share it in a different way. So I'm going to pull up a slideshow, and I want to share it where it's already in present mode. So what that means is they won't see any options to copy or you know, download or anything like that, all they will be able to do is see the actual slideshow. So I'm going to exit. There's two steps to this. The first step is you need to make it shareable. So when you click share, it just can't say restricted down here. So you need to go ahead and say you want to share it with just your school district or with anyone. I don't care which one. It just can't say restricted. And then I'm going to click done. First step is complete. The second step, you can actually use an extension, but I'm going to show you how to do it manually as well. So the extension is called Sir Links a Lot, and it's one of my favorites, like Sir Mix a Lot. Uh, so when you click it, you can say that you want to use preview mode. There's a lot of awesome buttons here, but I want to use preview mode. So this is the link that I would send to share this with people because when they go to it, it's going to open up in present or preview mode. Yay! And notice there's nowhere that they can go to like make a copy or anything like that. So they're just looking at the presentation. You can also do this with a doc, a Google doc. So I can come here. I can make sure that it's shareable. Do, do, do. Whenever it comes up, just waiting on it. All right, so I, it can't be restricted. It needs to be, you know, one or the other. Click done. I can click on Sir Links a Lot Preview. I just want to show you how this looks, and then I'm going to show you how to do it manually. So then, if I come here, you'll see that the doc opens up. What? Where's my toolbar? Where's all the stuff? No, no, no. I just want you to see it. I didn't want you to do anything else with it. I just wanted you to read it. Isn't that awesome? So the manual way to do it. So that's it. You're done. You can turn off the video. But the manual way to do it is to, you still have to do step one. But step two, you can do it without an extension. So what you would do is you would come up here to the link and you're going to find the word edit. It's always going to be somewhere at the end. And you're going to delete the word edit and anything that comes behind it. Delete the word edit and anything that comes behind it. If you only see the word edit, and delete the word edit. And you're going to type the word preview or you can type the word present. It just has to be lowercase. So just keep that in mind. And then this is the link. So link slide just kind of does this for you. But this is the link that you would send to people to put it in preview mode or present mode. So that is how you would do it. Same thing for here. I would delete the word edit. Type in preview if I can spell don't you judge me. And then there you go. So I would take this, I would send it to whoever I want to send it to, and they cannot steal my stuff. So you've learned two good ways to make people not gently reuse your stuff. Good luck.